Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I have got yet again another dupe for y'all. I know I'm a little behind on this one too, but not as behind as I was on artistry. So we are catching up finally. Today I have got the Dream State palette. This is off of Shop Hush. This is a bad habit and you all know that bad habit is my favorite dupe brand. If you open it up and look you get a mirror like always and here are the colors. This is a 15 shade pressed glitter palette. Um, it is a dupe for the Fenty Galaxy palette that came out around Christmas that ran around $65. And this one runs about $14, so you're getting like a $50 price break there. I used it to create this look. And so far, so good. <laughs> I'm going to get y'all some swatches and get y'all a tutorial just so you can see how all of this looks and how it swatches out. But before I do, be sure that if you haven't yet, go ahead and enter into my 1,000 subscriber giveaway. We are still somewhere between 800 and 900 right now. I want to go ahead and have this done by the end of the month. <clears throat> and I need y'all's help to do that. If you've already entered, go in and get your refer link. And you can get 25 extra referrals for friends that click on your link to enter the giveaway as well. So that is it. I'm going to quit rambling and we're going to go straight into your swatches and then straight into a tutorial. Okay, so here we've got some of our swatches. Now these first couple here don't look too impressive, but they lay down really well. <clears throat> and the farther down you get, the more pigmented these colors get, the darker they are. We've got three more. These are the last three colors. I ran out of room on my arm. These are super gorgeous. They are all glitter, which is why some of them do look kind of chalky and a little bit patchy, but they lay down and they layer really nicely. Okay, so since this palette is basically all shimmers, I couldn't pull a full eye look with it. Y'all know how that goes. So I went ahead and laid down just a little bit of a brown base in my crease. And now we are going to play with some of these on the lid. So I'm going to go ahead and zoom y'all in. Okay, so what I want to do is just take, I think I'm going to take this bright blue right here. And I'm also going to take Bliss, which is this really pretty peachy color. And I'm going to put the blue in my inner and outer and then the peachy in the middle and see how that goes. And I'm going to attempt this all with my finger and I promise nothing. <laughs> Okay, so the pigment is definitely there, and it's not hard to lay it down. That was really fast, really easy to do, so I'm just going to do the other eye real quick. Okay, and I am getting just a little bit of fallout down here. Nothing too major, nothing unexpected really. Just a little bit of it, <clears throat> which is okay with shimmers like this. Sometimes you get a little bit of fallout. Usually nothing too tragic. So I'm going to go ahead and just take Bliss and lay that down in the center of my lid and see how this goes. Okay, so these actually are working really well when it layered over. It kind of blended itself in and gave me a little bit of a purple vibe. So that is always a good thing. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do now is try to put a little bit of the shimmer on the lower lash line. And what I'm going to do is take Incubus right here on a small brush and just try to get that in the lower lash line. Okay, so as expected, since these are shimmers, that didn't work out quite so well as I wanted, but it's still really pretty. And just to finish out this look, I'm going to take Blur. This is just a straight silver and put that in the inner corner. Okay, 
Okay, so that is a very nice pop of color. I'm gonna go ahead and add it to my brow bone just a little bit, just kind of dab it on to get that shine right through there. And now it is time for me to go get my liner and my lashes and be right back. <laughs> Okay, so I went ahead and finished off my eyes, got some winged liner. Y'all, this winged liner stamp is my absolute best friend, if you didn't know. <laughs> and I got on some of the Benefit Their Real Mascara, which is amazing, and finished my lips off with some Crepe Vines lipstick. Tried to do a little bit of an ombre with a lip topper. I don't know, I'm really feeling it. <laughs> but uh, I finished this off, and for my final thoughts on this look, um, you know, this is a glitter palette, so you cannot use it by itself. You're going to need something to lay down in your crease. So this is not a standalone palette, but it lays down nicely. The pigment is really good. They basically blend themselves when you use more than one because they just kind of mesh into each other and make the perfect, like, ombre kind of effect. So honestly, I think this is a really good palette. I cannot speak for the palette. It dupes because I've never tried it because I couldn't afford it, but... This one is really good, absolutely in love with it, and will definitely be reaching for it often. <laughs> As always, I'm going to leave a link to purchase down there. I don't make any, any money off of it. This is just so that you can find the product if you want to get it yourself. And uh, yeah, that is it for today's video, and I will see y'all in a couple of days. Bye, you guys.